A religious conclave held between December 17 and 19, 2021 in Haridwar witnessed inflammatory and provocative speeches by proponents of Hindutva, many of them leaders of religious organizations. Reports say many of the speakers called for organized violence against Muslims and hinted at a Myanmar type cleansing campaign. There was a threat that if the government resisted the formation of a Hindu Rashtra, there will be an 1857 like revolt against the state. Political parties and concerned citizens have termed these as hate speech. They have demanded legal action against those involved in the propagation of hate and violence. There is no specific legal definition of hate speech. Provisions in law criminalize speeches, writings, actions, signs and representations that instigate violence and spread disharmony between communities and groups. These are understood to refer to hate speech. The Law Commission of India in its 267th report says Hate speech generally is an incitement to hatred primarily against a group of persons defined in terms of race, ethnicity, gender, sexual orientation, religious belief and the like. Thus, hate speech is any word written or spoken, signs, visible representations within the hearing or sight of a person with the intention to cause fear or alarm or incitement to violence. In general, hate speech is considered a limitation on free speech that seeks to prevent or bar speech that exposes a person or a group or section of society to hate violence ridicule or indignity sections 153a and 505 of the indian penal code are generally taken to be the main penal provisions that seek to punish hate speech and which deal with inflammatory speeches and expressions under section 153a promotion of enmity between different groups on grounds of religion race place of birth residence language etc and doing acts prejudicial to maintenance of harmony is an offence punishable with 3 years as imprisonment it attracts a 5 year term if committed in a place of worship or an assembly engaged in religious worship or religious ceremonies Section 505 of IPC makes it an offence to make statements conducing to public mischief. The statement, publication, report or rumour that is penalised under Section 505, subsection 1 should be one that promotes mutiny by the armed forces or causes such fear or alarm that people are induced to commit an offence against the state or public tranquillity or is intended to incite or incites any class or community to commit an offence against another class or community this attracts a jail term of up to 3 years under 505 subsection 2 it is an offence to make statements creating or promoting enmity hatred or ill will between classes under subsection 3 the same offence will attract up to a 5 year jail term if it takes place in a place of worship or in any assembly engaged in religious worship or religious ceremonies the law commission has proposed that separate offences be added to the ipc to criminalize hate speech quite specifically instead of being subsumed in the existing sections concerning inflammatory acts and speeches